welcome to our channel if you like our videos and do sub subscribe to our channel also press the bell icon so that you can get all the new video notification as soon as they are released so today's topic is malignant hyperthermia so what are the causative drugs for this condition so causative drugs for malignant hyperthermia can be divided into four groups the first group is muscle relaxants. In muscle relaxant, the succinylcholine is the most common cause of malignant hyperthermia. The second group is inhalational general anesthetics. And in this, we have two kinds of drug. The most common agent causing uh, in this group uh, is halothen. While other drugs include sevoflurane, desflurane, isoflurane, and methoxyflurane. So in inhalational general anesthetic, the most common cause is halothen. In muscle relaxant, the most common cause is succinylcholine. So if any of these two is given in your MCQ option, then always go for that. Local anesthetic like ignocan can also cause uh, malignant hyperthermia. The other drugs uh, which can cause malignant hyperthermia are tricyclic antidepressant, MAO inhibitors and phenothiazine. So as you can see, these are the list of common drugs which can cause malignant hyperthermia. Succinylcholine, halothane, fluorin drugs, lignocaine and tricyclic antidepressant, MAO inhibitors and phenothiazine. Now, how can you uh, diagnose malignant hyperthermia? Or what are the signs and symptoms of presentation of hyperthermia? There will be tachycardia, that is increase in heart rate, along with hypertension, that is increase in blood pressure. The respiratory rate is also increased, so there is tachypnea. Along with that, uh, there is increase in temperature that includes fever and that's why we call it as hyperthermia. There is increased carbon dioxide level which can lead to the acidosis and hyperkalemia. So these conditions are also associated with malignant hyperthermia and while treating it we should also uh, treat these causes also. And along with all of this there will be skeletal muscle rigidity. Now, how to treat malignant hyperthermia? For treatment, uh, the drug of choice is an intramuscular dentroline. So, dentroline is the drug of choice for uh, treatment of malignant hyperthermia. But along with that, you have to also treat uh, associated conditions, uh, which include Obviously, the cessation of causative agent or causative drugs which has started it, you have to stop that drug. You have to give sodium bicarbonate to treat the acidosis which is there. And along with that, you have to also treat the hyperkalemia. And fluids are given to maintain the urine output. But the drug of choice is intramuscular dentroline. Thank you for watching this video.